Hello everyone, have you heard about Bard extensions? They're a new way to interact with Bard that allows you to bring other Google tools and services into Bard. In this video, I'll show you how to use them and give you some examples of how they can help you be more productive and creative. So stay tuned. Bard extensions are a new way to interact with Bard. Extensions allow you to bring other Google tools and services into Bard so you can access all the information you need in one place. Benefits of using Bard extensions. There are many benefits to using Bard extensions, including saving time. Bard extensions can save you time by allowing you to access all the information you need in one place. For example, you can use the Gmail extension to search your Gmail inbox for emails about Bard without having to switch to Gmail. Increased efficiency. Bard extensions can help you to be more efficient by allowing you to automate tasks. For example, you can use the Google Docs extension to insert a Bard prompt into a Google Doc, and Bard will automatically generate text based on the prompt. Improved creativity. Bard extensions can help you to be more creative by giving you access to a wider range of information and tools. For example, you can use the YouTube extension to search for YouTube videos about Bard prompts, which can inspire you to come up with new ideas. How to activate and use extensions? To activate and use extensions, simply follow these steps. Go to bard.google.com and sign in to your account. Click on the extensions icon in the top right corner of the screen. Toggle on the extensions that you want to use. Once you have activated an extension, you can use it in Bard by typing in a prompt that includes the extension's name. For example, to use the Gmail extension, you could type in the prompt, search my Gmail for emails about Bard. How to use multiple extensions in a single prompt. You can use multiple extensions in a single prompt by typing in a prompt that includes the names of the extensions that you want to use. For example, to use the Gmail and Google Docs extensions in a single prompt, you could type in the prompt, search my Gmail for emails about Bard and insert the results into a Google Doc. How to call out extensions using the at symbol. You can also call out extensions using the at symbol. To do this, simply type in the at symbol and then the name of the extension that you want to use. For example, to call out the Gmail extension, you could type in the at symbol and then the word Gmail. How to use extensions with your own data. You can use extensions with your own data, Google Drive and Gmail, by following these steps. Go to the extensions page and toggle on the Google Workspace extension. Connect your Google Drive and Gmail accounts. Once you have connected your Google Drive and Gmail accounts, you can use extensions with your own data by typing in a prompt that includes the name of the extension and the name of the file or email that you want to access. For example, to use the Google Drive extension to access a file called Bard Course, you could type in the prompt at Google Drive, Bard Course. Examples of how to use Bard extensions. Here are a few examples of how Bard extensions can be used for specific tasks. Google Flights. The Google Flights extension allows you to search for flights directly from within Bard. To use the extension, simply type in a prompt that includes the name of the extension and the information you are looking for. For example, to find a round-trip flight from New York to Los Angeles on October 1st, returning on October 7th, you would type in the following prompt. At Google Flights, find a round-trip flight from New York to Los Angeles on October 1st, returning on October 7th. BARD will then return a list of flights that match your criteria, along with information such as the price, duration, and airline. You can also use the Google Flights extension to filter your results by price, duration, airline, and other criteria. Google Hotels. The Google Hotels extension allows you to search for hotels directly from within BARD. To use the extension, simply type in a prompt that includes the name of the extension and the information you are looking for. For example, to find a hotel in San Francisco with four or more star ratings and free parking, you would type in the following prompt. At Google Hotels, find a hotel in San Francisco with four or more star ratings and free parking. Bard will then return a list of hotels that match your criteria, along with information such as the price, location, and amenities. You can also use the Google Hotels extension to filter your results by price, location, amenities, and other criteria. Google Maps. The Google Maps extension 
allows you to get directions, find places, and explore maps directly from within BARD. To use the extension, simply type in a prompt that includes the name of the extension and the information you are looking for. For example, to get directions from your home to the nearest Starbucks, you would type in the following prompt at Google Maps. Give me directions from my home to the nearest Starbucks. BARD will then open Google Maps and show you directions to the nearest Starbucks. You can also use the Google Maps extension to find places, such as restaurants, parks, and museums. You can also explore maps of different locations around the world. YouTube. The YouTube extension allows you to search for and watch YouTube videos directly from within BARD. To use the extension, simply type in a prompt that includes the name of the extension and the information you are looking for. For example, to find a YouTube video about how to use the BARD API, you would type in the following prompt, at YouTube, find a YouTube video about how to use the BARD API. BARD will then open YouTube and show you a list of videos that match your criteria. You can then select a video to watch. You can also use the YouTube extension to play and pause videos, adjust the volume, and skip to different parts of the video. Google Workspace. The Google Workspace extension allows you to access and manage your Google Workspace tools and data directly from within BARD. To use the extension, simply type in a prompt that includes the name of the extension and the information you are looking for. For example, to search your Gmail for emails about BARD extensions, you would type in the following prompt at Google Workspace. Search my Gmail for emails about BARD extensions. BARD will then search your Gmail for emails about BARD extensions and return a list of results. You can also use the Google Workspace extension to access and manage your Google Calendar, Google Docs, and other Google Workspace tools. I hope this explanation is helpful. Please let me know if you have any other questions. Tips for using BARD extensions effectively. Here are a few tips for using BARD extensions effectively. Be specific in your prompts. The more specific you are in your prompts, the better the results will be. Use examples. If you're not sure how to write a prompt, try using an example. For example, if you want to use the Gmail extension to search for emails about BARD, you could use the prompt, search my Gmail for emails about BARD, similar to the email from Andrew dated September 22, 2023. Experiment. Don't be afraid to experiment with BARD. Thanks for watching. I hope you learned something new about BARD extensions. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. I encourage you to try out BARD extensions for yourself and see how they can help you be more productive and creative. I'm excited to see how people use BARD extensions to create new and innovative things.